being nocturnal. Seven oh six right now. Got to get the day started, and I haven't slept all night. All right, extra shoes, set up, tripod. I think we are about ready to go. I'm gonna go ahead and pump gas and then we're heading off to Etowah Skate Park. We're at Etowah Skate Park now. Feeling some fatigue, but I think I can put in a good session. So, this is what I forgot to do while I was at home. I usually do word of the day, just to boost my vocabulary. And today's word is behoof. And it means benefit or advantage. And I showed an image of a salad and water. All right, let's do this. You're actually joking. That is a huge pond. I was expecting a pond, but not that big. Goodness gracious. Hopefully I could still put in a good session. Okay, so I think this apple was rotten. So not exactly behoofing here. This is for a public sandwich. All right, just finished my session at Etowah. Really indecisive as to what to do next. Oh my gosh, you better not get in here. What the heck? Okay, I think maybe it's lunchtime, so I'm gonna take a trip to Publix. I think I got most of everything. All right, I picked up my Publix groceries and I really don't know what to do from here. I guess I'm gonna go back home. I made it back home and it's still really early in the day. It's not even two o'clock in the afternoon yet. 
So I'm gonna go ahead and have my lunch. I have my public sandwich, as I said while I was at Edelwall. And I also have my kombucha. I've never had this flavor before. It's watermelon wonder. And before I do all of this, I'm gonna go ahead and check my weight because I'm a little bit curious as to what it is because I didn't quite have a breakfast. I only drank water for breakfast because my apple was rotten. So let's go ahead and check my weight. 172.4. I think if I were to do the yogurt and banana breakfast, I would have been at 169, but that'll do too. I am so excited for this lunch. I haven't eaten all day. I haven't slept all night. I completely deserve this. After all the skating I've done, after all the clips I've gotten, I just, I needed this. Like, even having that rotten apple, my gosh, that was so revolting. It tasted like sand. It doesn't really count, so my only breakfast was just a bottle of water. Yeah, I'm just so grateful to have this right now. <laughs> Alright, so this day in the life continues. It looks a lot nicer right now. It was like super cloudy earlier. <gasps> you... Ah, ah, ah. I haven't seen you all day, girl. How you doing, huh? How you doing? Alright. So, in the garage now. I'm gonna put in another skate session in, but it's just a bunch of flight ground tricks. I'm gonna see if I can do ten of them. Alright, that was 10 flight ground tricks. I'm gonna wipe all this sweat off, go inside, shower, and I guess we'll go ahead and play horror games afterwards. Alright, I switched into some jogger pants because it's really cold right now. I'm actually starving, so I'm gonna go ahead and make dinner right now. Alright, I'm gonna have my dinner now, and as I'm having dinner, I'm gonna have a little bit of a Friday movie night here. We got Christine by John Carpenter. There is a book of it by Stephen King, and I do have it, but it's at my old house, and I have not completed it. Alright, I am ready to record. Got my lights on, got a bottle of water in case I need to clear my throat when I'm doing the commentary. Got Audacity on, got Fraps on, so all I have to do is open up this game. I also need to set up the green screen, so I'm going to do that right now. Alright, let's get started. Welcome to the House of Kittens, everyone. This is Fucat, and today we are playing Hillbilly Highway. Okay, so I guess I'm supposed to find a way to get there. And I've noticed there's a lot of warehouse trailers here. So, I'm to assume that he sells millions of chainsaws through this. That's a behoof for his salary. Absolutely behoofing. Alright, so the playthrough is done. All I have to do is turn off the lights, put the green screen back, and get to editing from here. And I didn't record the concluded part of the behind the scenes because my camera turned off for some reason. I don't know if my camera died or something, but we're going to get to editing now. And the first rendering has begun. I'm gonna render it again on Sony Vegas to compress the file and compress it again on Handbrake. So 
While this is all going on, I am watching the Phuket show to pretty much entertain myself. I always have this on rerun because I just love recording these outdoor vlogs. Now it's time to edit the main dish. We're going to go ahead and open up Sony Vegas and produce the final product. The final rendering has begun. Shouldn't take too long, it's only going to take 48 minutes apparently, so I'm going to go ahead and just wait on this, and then I'm going to edit the thumbnail and then compress it on handbrake, and then, well I'm not going to upload this because this is actually a future playthrough, so you can expect this in a few weeks. So the sun's rising, video's already done, but... I'm just going to conclude the video here. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. I'm going to go to sleep now because I am absolutely fatigued. So I'll see you guys in another video. Hopefully you all enjoyed this day in the life. I know it wasn't really that much, but it had to be better than the way I did two years ago. So got to appreciate it. See you guys in the next video. Stay awesome, kitty savers.